should I uh, should I show them what I gotta show them, babies? Huh? Should I show them what I gotta show them? Should I show you what I gotta show you? I'm not talking about my OnlyFans right now, okay? I'm not talking about that. You wanna see that? Go pay like everybody else. I'm talking about that room right there that's gonna be my gym room. I committed myself to completely building this as a gym room. All right, let's see what's going on here. And this is my gym room, a very incomplete gym room. I'm still setting up my things, but these are all dumbbells ranging from five pound pairs to 115 pound pairs. They're all scattered, don't worry about it, I'm gonna set it up. Uh, I've got myself a lot of rubber padding to save the floors. And I got myself brand new barbells right here from Rogue Canada. I got very lucky uh, they're out because they're out of stock right now. But this is a Ohio Power Bar, an e-coated Ohio Power Bar. Basically, like this is the the knurling is all made from electronically. I'm I'm not sure exactly how it's made, but it's a very nice, very nice feeling, very grippy, but not too overly aggressive. That was important to me to get a center knurling. A lot of barbells don't have that center knurling. That's very important for squats right there. Um, this is a BNR 2.0. A multi-purpose bar from Row Canada again. They're brand new. Both of them are brand new barbells. Like, <laughs> look at that knurling. This is a less aggressive knurling than that. The knurling is what it's the grip basically. The grip on this is much less aggressive than this one. So I'm. This is more of like a overall good barbell for anything you want to do basically. But they're both amazing. Like it just depends on what you want to do. And um, I like that there's two rings and there's only one on that one so you know you can really have fun with it and here <laughs> big piece of equipment that i got is a rogue bench that was very very important to me to get a solid solid bench and i'm, I'm like rogue has the best quality stuff so I might as well buy it like and I, it's expensive but long term this shit is gonna last me forever like look at the, the sturdiness on that that's so fucking very, very, very solid. You can have uh, hundreds of pounds on there. It's never gonna <laughs> budge. And here you can really set up how you want your bench. You can have it there. You can have it at a 90 degree angle. And this part as well, they're both separate. You can both move them how you want them. And you can move, if you want it's a 95 pound bench. This is 95 pounds. So you wanna move this big boy. You're gonna have to grab it like this. And then lift it up like this. And then it has some it has some wheels in the back, and when you put it back down, te technically I'm not, I, I don't even need to be on the rubber because it already has like rubber paddings on the wheels, but just want to make sure it's safe, you know, want to make sure the floor is good. Um, barbell holder, the only reason I put these barbells on the ground right there is to show you better because the lighting in that corner is kind of shit. I got a barbell holder, very basic, but it saves a lot of space. Easy bar curl, tricep extension bar, Swiss bar basically. And these, I'm waiting on more plates. They're back order for like five to six months, but it's gonna be worth the wait. And uh, this right here, all this is a dumbbell rack. I just need to assemble it with the bolts and I'm gonna be able to hold at least maybe half that. That was a lot of talking. I'm done talking now, I wanna train, I wanna lift. This is gonna be my first workout in this gym. Well, my home gym, oh, I'm excited. <laughs> it's, it's weird to say that, but I'm excited. Let's get it. I'm gonna put these barbells away. Let's get a workout, chest and triceps today. Before even laying down, what I do, I take my dumbbell, put them as close to my stomach as possible, or and then, what I do, I take a deep breath while laying on my back. So a deep breath while laying back. Just like this. Set my dumbbells up. Before even pressing, I take another deep breath. And then when I press, I explode my air. So exploding my air. And I inhale on the way down. Inhale, keep my stomach tight. And on the way up, I exhale my air. Inhale on the way down, exhale on the way up. 
Last warm up set. Let's go. Let's get it. Stronger. I'm weak right now. Holy shit. I'm disappointed. I got five reps. Wow. It's all good. We're gonna get bigger. We're gonna get stronger. And we're gonna get more athletic. That's the whole point of this room right here. Let's lower the weights, shall we? <laughs> Alright, I was supposed to lower the weights, right? But my ego got in the way and I'm gonna try a second set. I want six reps now. I want six at least. Let's get it, all right? I took a long break. I took four minute breaks. I should be good. Let's go. Come on, come here. That's what a brand new plate looks like. Just done setting this up. This is why I got this bar right here for this reason. People asked me for a cat update the other day and well Leo is doing very well he's getting bigger last time you saw him he was about I'd say five pounds I think and now he's 6.3 pounds last time I, I went to the vet like um, last week actually so he's getting bigger and he's only keep in mind that he's only a baby he's only uh, five months old so he's, he's gonna be a big boy and Bella's doing fine as well like, Bella, yeah, they're doing good. Let me flip them. I mean, look at them. Are you guys doing good? Huh? I hope you are. You look very fucking comfy right now. Huh? 
Yeah, yeah. And look at him. He's almost, he's getting a, as big as her. Uh, he's 6 pounds. She's 7.5 pounds. So <laughs> he's going to catch up fast. He's such a beautiful baby. Show everybody your stomach. Show everybody your abs. Everybody wants to see your abs. Look at that. Look at that beautiful stomach right there. He's so beautiful. My little Leo. My little leopard. Leopard. That's why I call him Leo, by the way, because he looks like a little leopard. Uh, leopard, sorry. Look at the paws on that. You got some big paws, buddy. You're going to be a big boy. Anyways, you're doing good.